if you are satisfied with the way the Medicare Advantage plan is working for you, if your doctors that you want to go to still accept the plan, if the prescription medications that you take on a regular basis are still covered on the plan, if you take no action, and if the plan is still available in your area for the following year, then if you take no action, you will automatically renew for another year. As we mentioned before, with the Part D prescription drug plan, you will also receive an annual notice of change packet. You want to review this packet because, again, there can be changes to your Medicare Advantage plan. They can change the monthly premium. They can change the benefits. There might be some doctors leaving the network. Some of your medicines, the way they are covered, might change. Another thing that you can do during the annual election period is change from a Medicare supplement plan to a Medicare Advantage plan. Medicare Advantage plans, except for in-stage renal disease, do not ask any health questions. If you want to change from a Medicare supplement policy to a Medicare Advantage policy, as long as you submit your application to the Medicare Advantage carrier from October 15th through December 7th, your policy will be issued and your new policy will start on January 1 of the following year. Another change that can be made during the annual election period is you can change from one Medicare Advantage plan to a different Medicare Advantage plan, either with the same company or with a different company. 